And arts and sciences converge in New Orleans East thanks to the Mackey brothers, both spearheading their own multi-million dollar projects near Reed Boulevard. Caitlin Rust spoke with Dr. Calvin Mackey about what he hopes this will spark. Whatever our children need, all paths will lead to New Orleans East for them. A barren stretch on either side of I-10 in the Little Woods neighborhood now has hope it will bloom with both arts and sciences. When you look at the uh, deployment of assets in a city, it seemed like New Orleans East uh, has been left out. And sometimes it seemed like it's by design. Founder and CEO of STEM NOLA, Dr. Calvin Mackey, says when you look at the needs of a community, New Orleans East just makes sense to develop for he and his brother, actor Anthony Mackey. It has one of the largest population densities uh, in the city and is very underserved. While the city booms with film and TV production, Marvel's newest Captain America, Anthony Mackie, just finished buying 20 acres of land to house a studio and his production company, East Studios, a stone's throw away across the interstate from the 42,000 square foot site donated to STEM NOLA by Auctioner to create a STEM innovation hub for black excellence. We're trying to create the the NOCA of STEM, right? If a kid comes up in a third grade, like my son, and said, Daddy, I believe I can prove time travel, or like my other little nephew in the 10th grade who said he wanted artificial intelligence, learn about artificial intelligence, there's nowhere for them to go. It's not only going to be a headquarters, but also house laboratory space, classrooms, and cutting edge technology to educate and connect students to STEM careers and skills as more industries in the field move south. So we are building a cradle to career pipeline so our kids can take advantage of cybersecurity, artificial intelligence, uh, machine learning, uh, 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 big data, uh, predictive analytics. There's 150,000 K-12 students that are thirsting for what we are bringing to New Orleans East. And with the interstate, being right there on the interstate, all of these school systems will have direct access to some of the most uh, advanced technology that our children need in the 21st century. This on top of the expansive STEM district Dr. Mackey will be working on in the first phase of the Bayou Phoenix project, reviving the old Six Flags site. I walked out in New Orleans East one day and I saw what somebody saw 50 years ago in, in North Carolina. A guy looked at the map and he saw he had a density of universities and colleges. He drew a triangle and he said his research triangle. And they've done a trillion dollars in economic development over the last 50 years. I mean, we can create a technological STEM hub district that can serve the entire region. Dr. Mackey says the hub should be done by the summer of 2024 and will be ready to partner with all of the colleges and universities as well as K through 12 schools and other STEM organizations. It's going to be able to serve everyone.